So this is Mike Hendricks, and Mike runs the camera department. And Mike, thanks for taking the time to no show problem. us around. And I know you do a, a lot more than just send cameras out to get beat up in all sorts of crazy places. Um, tell us about your operation. Okay, sure. Uh, I brought out a couple of, uh, of our cameras. Uh, first off, let me start by saying at the camera department here, we design, build, and maintain large format film and digital cameras. So what I've got here is a selection of uh, 2D, 3D, and digital cameras to show you. I thought I'd start with, this is an older model camera, but this camera is unique in that this is the camera that they carry to the top of Mount Everest. So for that particular production, we needed to do a, a fair bit of customization in this camera where we designed electronics to operate down to minus 40 degrees. We also had to take a fair bit of weight out of this camera so the Sherpas could, could manage carrying this to the top of Everest. All of our film cameras run a 15 perf 65 millimeter film frame. The idea being that if you start with a really high quality image at the capture end, that feeds all the way through and, and helps us to get that best quality image up on the IMAX screens. This is a, a more modern camera. Uh, you'll see that it's a much cleaner design. It's quicker to load uh, and helps us on, on location when we're working, say, particularly with Hollywood productions. Uh, this camera here is our most popular 2D camera. As I say, it's lightweight, it's quick to load, it's got a, a several advanced features that this older model camera does not have. We've had a number of unfortunate situations. One where an ultralight crashed and the camera was completely destroyed. Uh, more recently, the Catwoman actually ran into one of these cameras, which required a, a major rework of the film chamber, film magazines. We take these cameras into some pretty crazy places. With all of our cameras, we also have a complete suite of lenses, underwater housings, enabling us to film virtually anywhere. We needed to design something that was better suited for space. This is our space camera. Uh, this camera has flown several missions on the shuttle and has also been used extensively in the space station. Uh, this camera is unique in that we expose right and left eye images on the same strip of film, and then we later scan those images and extract the right and left eye prints from a single strip of film. We're now working with digital camera systems and uh, this is just a prototype setup of one of our newer uh, cameras that we're developing. We do all of that development work here in house and um, again this camera here, the intent of this is to design and build a camera that would be suited for commercial use uh, yet uh, be a, a higher resolution than any other camera system that currently exists.